Hello everyone, Aaron from ASM Computing here again. This tutorial is going to be showing you how to change um, the time it takes when your computer actually loads into your main desktop. From the time it takes to select start for all your programs to open up, um, it normally takes about 30 seconds default, but I'm going to be showing you how to change it to 3 seconds. So although you've got items down here to the right loading, you'll still be able to click on start and still be able to get into your programs and files after 3 seconds. And I'll also be showing you how to, with the um, boot menu, normally you see this screen when it loads, this one here. Now there is a way you can actually change this so you don't have to see this boring screen all the time it loads and the one we'll change it to will look like this this one here so it's still not as good but it looks better than the little bar I keep going across right I'll start with the start bar to load up quicker on that Basically what you want to do is go to start, all programs, guess what guys, it's run again, select run, here you want to type msconfig -S and click ok. Sorry guys, just waiting for it to open. Now here, you should get this box pop up. Now, be careful when changing any settings in this part of the control, as this is actually, as it says at the top, the system configuration. Anything change you don't know will make your computer run bad, or it may even block you out, or could give you errors. So don't change anything unless you know how. So basically on the tabs at the top, we want to go to boot. And where it's got timeout, 30 seconds as I said before, that is the default time. So all we need to do is just take the zero out and leave it at three. And also here, when I was saying about these two boot screens, the way to change it to the second one I showed you, I'll just show you again. The way to change it to this one, rather than the standard boring default one. So I'm just waiting for this to close. I'll move. Sorry guys, it's because I've got the camera recording. Um, basically all you need to do is tick no GUI boot and then just apply and then click OK. As I'm not going to actually have this going um, because I've got no way of showing you obviously that it works, um, I can guarantee it does but obviously for me to restart the computer you, w you won't see it. So I'm not going to actually have that. I'm going to leave the 3 seconds part there, but I'm just going to leave mine as it is for now. Um, all you do is just apply and then OK, and it should come up with another box and restart. So just don't show me this message again and exit without restart. Or if you're not actually doing anything on your computer, then I'd recommend you click restart. But as I'm actually recording, obviously I can't at the moment. So that's that little trick, um, do it, restart the computer, see what it's like, if you don't like it, just come back, watch this video, so you can find out how to get back into that again, if you can't remember, um, watch how I selected the no GUI boot, and just basically untick it, 
and then select apply and OK again and it will go back to normal. OK guys well I'll be doing another tutorial soon. Um, not too sure what it's going to be yet but hopefully something you like and I'll put it up soon. Well, see you later guys and please as I say or as I always say please rate and comment and I'll see you all soon. Okay, cheers.